Um, okay, so basically, uh, like my partner says, uh, the Endangerment Act should definitely stay in place to uh, protect these death smells, um, just like they've uh, <coughs> protected animals such as like the bald eagle and um, other important animals. Um, uh, uh, my partner also mentioned that uh, getting rid of the weeds to that uh, slow down the current of the delta uh, would be very cost effective um, compared to the two gates project. Um, it would definitely raise the population of the delta smelt because according to uh, many studies that uh, they would survive in such conditions if the weeds were removed. Um, yeah, we just basically um, let the delta smell population grow, and soon they'd be removed from the endangered species list, um, like the bald eagle. Um, one point I'd also like to ba uh, bring up is that uh, the these delta smell definitely need to uh, stay in, in the delta because it's uh, their native terrain. Um, because recently, uh, biologists have been doing research in uh, labs <laughs> trying to breed them to kind of uh, bring them up. And um, one biologist at UC Davis says that uh, captive breeding might be good for producing fish for research, but it is unlikely to be much use to restoring the population. <coughs> And um, John Lindbergh also says, who is also a researcher at um, UC Davis, said that uh, we're not strongly in favor of it unless it's absolutely necessary. And of course, she's speaking of these um, hatcheries, which are breeding the uh, delta smell. Um, and then, contra Costa Times, uh, Bruce Herbold, a biologist at the U.S. Environmental Protection <laughs> Agency. Um, uh, he says that about these hatcheries, that uh, you'll end up with fish that are not able to do well in the wild. So, and because they service indicator fish that uh, show whether the water would be safe to use or not, um, it would be very smart to keep them in the delta because the amount of water that goes through to farms. Um, um, also, the partner mentions that um, the delta smelt should stay and the pump should not turn on because it may potentially serve more purposes, um, meaning uh, <coughs> It could probably be more than just food for other fish, and probably be more than an indicator fish, even though that's still pretty big. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs>